We've seen Knox, Godfrey Stewart, and Belfield. So can you guess which choir is about to hit the ATS stage next? It's the only Kingston school left in the competition. Please help me welcome the school that has been staying alive all throughout the competition, and we have yet to catch them being complacent. Dubbed the winning right now choir, who could it be? And what's Kempo doing? Give it up for Kempo Down High School. that Camperdown was in the top four, I said, yes! Because after that performance of that Hamilton piece there last week, I said to myself, I hope I hear from Camperdown again. Now, listen to me. You're singing some songs that you don't even know about <laughs> because you were not born when these songs were around. This was when I was at school. And uh, you have taken them, <laughs> and, uh, and uh, the, the transitions were beautiful, um, you colored you colored the the songs even more than what we what we know, and also everybody was so engaged. This is a winning number. This is a winning choir. <laughs> you talk you talk about when you were at school. That wasn't so long ago. <laughs> <laughs> um, Camperdown. I'm I'm really trying to control myself again, <laughs> but that was up like seventy seven. Ain't no stopping you now. Hey, 
Ain't no stopping this choir. They have been on a roll all season. If you believe Camperdown deserves a spot in the grand finale on December 10, then call or text the word VOTE to 444-8804. We are upon our second break and all together sing Don't You Move a Muscle because the second round is up next. We'll be right back.